just got back from hunting figures. Shopping bags pretty fine, bitches. Filters call, got a pickup figures. Look at me, I'm a geek, tripping. Future waves, I will be copping. Come check with me, you know I got it. Figure what? Small from legends, dudes doing them reviews, fella. What's going on? It's your boy, that was dude. And you know I got it, so subscribe. What's going on? It's your boy that was doing today. We're doing another action figure review. Today we're gonna to be taking a look at the Marvel Legends Infinite Series A Avengers Age of Ultron Hulk figure. Big shout out to Oh uh, man, who I got this from? Oh, Ryan Jacoby, yeah. My boy back there. Uh he wanted to trade for it, but I had nothing. Well, I had nothing I was willing to give up. And um, he told me, right, you give it, I'll sell it to you, $16. And I bought it. Uh, he comes with... Hulk comes with... Uh, the right hand of Thanos. <coughs> so, yeah. He comes with the right hand of Thanos. And I gotta say, I really, really like this figure. Um, he is massive. He is massively tall. I wish he was a bit wider. Like the first first Avengers release of him. Uh, my only complaint is that. And I don't like the, the gap in between the, tor the top of the torso and the bottom. And the, the green is, is movie accurate. But I wish. Well the camera's not really picking it up. The camera's picking up the green that I. The green. The light is giving off the green. That I wish he looked, but he's a bit more olivey, um, looking in in by, by the human eye, and um, but again, it's movie accurate, so it's cool. I do like it though. This fig this figure is a massive. It is actually bigger than the Thanos bath, from what I understand, and from from the other reviews I've been seeing. I really like this man. This figure is awesome. I love the head sculpt. I like the new look. That he'll have in the film. He has a pair of pants that don't rip. I guess you know we could say Reed Richard developed a, a fabric, so to speak, that conforms to him when he's human and it expands when he becomes the Hulk. I guess even though Reed Richards is not in the movie, wink, wink, we know that. But um, yeah, man, this figure is sick. This figure is awesome. It's massive. See, this is my hand. Look, my hand covers the whole leg. And I have big hands, so you should see. That should tell you how big this bad boy is. Look at that face sculpt. He's pissed. <sighs> he got nipples. They gave him nipples. I like this torso joint, but I hate the gappage between it, you see? Doesn't look right, but... I mean, it is what it is. It's the only thing they can do with such a big figure like this. I love this, man. All new scope work. All new... The arms, the arms are massive. Really like that. I really like that he had two closed fists too. <laughs> really nice looking figure, man. They nailed it. This is the must. This is definitely one of the must gets to me. Cause it's new. It's all new. Love it. I, I have to put it so far back, just so I could get in the camera fully. Uh, <clears throat> really like it, man. Sweet looking figure. Look at the back. The back is nice. Textured pants. Got the Avengers logo, the red line. It's really sweet, man. Can't wait. I can't wait till the movie. May needs the herb and get here. Hulk smash! His articulation is pretty decent for a big guy. His head doesn't go up much down either. Does look side to side. He got beautiful ball joint shoulders, beautiful bicep suit. Double joint elbow, which is something we don't normally get with big figures, but we do get them as of late. He has um, hinged wrists, so they go forward and back, and the swivels. He has upper torso, like an ab crunch, diaphragm movement. Does go side to side, the twists. Does an ab crunch. No waist swivel. Beautiful ball joint and hips that go all the way out. Upper thigh swivel. Double jointed knee. And his ankle pivots, he got a rocker and it pivots 
down and up. Definitely a must have. Very big figure. Really love this figure, man. I, I've, been, I've been playing with it crazy. I've been having him fighting on um, my two bath man droids that I had. I took some pictures on my Facebook page. And then I put them up against uh, DC Signature Series Doomsday for Fantasy Matchup Friday on Facebook. And I said, who would win? Oh! You heard that? I had him up for fantasy matchup Friday against DC Signature Series Doomsday, and I was asking who would win. And um, it was actually a pretty good turnout. It was on my personal page, and then I put it. I also put it in the Marvel Legends group, the Marvel Legends community group, um, and it, it did pretty well. Uh, it was back and forth, but uh, safe to say, I think Hulk was the winner in that battle, regardless. Well, that's the review. Hit the like button if you're feeling it. Leave a comment. Definitely pick this guy up. He is Devil Do certified. I've been having so much fun with him. You got to have this guy. Follow my Instagram and Twitter. Like my Facebook page. Holler at me in general. You already know. It's your boy Devil's Dude. And I'm out. One. Get my crush.